Now to our latest Eight Who Care Award winner. Every week, we're introducing you to someone who's making a difference in our community. WGAL News 8's Jerry Gish introduces us to Kristen Herzog, who's helping people in one of the poorest countries in the world by bringing people together here in the Susquehanna Valley. We can make a difference. You never know when a life-changing moment may come, forever changing your path. We can provide. And the difference you can make in the world. For Kristen Herzog, it happened when she was just 16. I was walking down the street in, in Port-au-Prince. Kristen was on a church mission trip to Haiti, walking in a large group of Americans, when for some reason, she was chosen. A woman, Haitian woman, came up to me, threw this crumpled up towel in my arms, and ran away. And I realized that this towel had started moving in my hands. And I opened it up, and inside was this beautiful little Haitian girl. And um, I started screaming, somebody help me, this lady just handed me her baby and ran away. Others in Kristen's group were able to track down the woman and return the infant. But what the woman said as she took her child back has stayed with Kristen to this day. She looked at me and she said, I thought you could give my daughter a better life in America. And it was one of those aha moments. Even at 16, Kristen was moved. Wednesday, March 8th, 1989. She wrote about it that night in her journal making a vow to herself. A lady handed me her baby and told me that I could give her a better life in America. I'm going to adopt someday a little Haitian girl when I am married and have my own house. Indeed, years later, Kristen adopted a young Haitian girl who is now her 16-year-old daughter, Taisha. Ever since I've known her, Haiti's been in her blood. But Kristen wanted to do more to help others like that woman so desperate she would give her baby to a stranger. And again, Kristen has made it happen. She's visited Haiti 75 times in the past 30 years and raised money to make a difference in a country she now considers a second home. The purpose of this is we want to see people become gainfully employed. The Hope for Haiti benefit auction. For the past seven years, Kristen has headed up the Hope for Haiti auction, which has raised money for everything from a library and books to education and job initiatives on the island. We are looking at ways to help Haiti, help the Haitians become more self-sustainable, whether it be opening up a library or opening up a computer center. She's now making a difference in many lives, all thanks to one chance encounter so many years ago. I wish I could thank her for that. You know, I wish I could just say, thank you for giving me that opportunity to get connected on that emotional level so that I can use my future life to help other people on a, on a bigger scale. Jerry Gish, WGAL News 8.